What is this? And who are you? those pieces? Well, uh, this one is actually a uh, more artistic piece. Uh, I created it as a bench as first, um, but it can also be used as a uh, coffee table. As you can see, you can open some of them. Oh la la, that's my secret. Uh, <laughs> It's a secret pocket. Safe. <laughs> so you can put magazines or maybe even like uh, bottles and have like some kind of a cocktail table. So it started out as, I would say, a little bit of an error. Um, it was, I was making a 3D for a client and uh, this was a leftover of a 3D building. So, but I, I found the shape so beautiful that I wanted to exploit it. So I thought first as a as a jewelry piece, and from a jewelry piece it created. You uh, created the jewelry piece. Yes, it's actually right here. And then from there I started to build up the idea of creating a furniture piece, and that's how I created it. Um, the, the material is uh, inox and uh, rusted uh, metal. So there's an entire process of uh, making the, the metal rust. So it took a couple of weeks of uh, How long does it take for metal to rust? It's about two weeks. Um, it's a mixture of salt, water, and um, some other products uh, with water. And um, so it's all the time. Oh, it's every time you, you put the, the product on it, you have to water on it and put back and back the, the application and then you get those rusted um, appearance. So what is your name? My name? Oh, my name is Lore Arts. And what is the name of your art? Uh, this one is called Spine because it was a mixture of the spine of a person and also a, it's a command in AutoCAD that's actually making um, straight lines into a curve. So it was basically the name came out of those inspirations. And where do you live? I live in Carcassonne. And uh, where do you work? I, live, I work in Carcassonne too. <laughs> and where are you from? Uh, well, that's a long story. Uh, I was born and raised in France, but my parents are Belge and Dutch. And I did my uh, education in New York. I went to the New York School of Interior Design, studied there for four years, worked there a little bit, and came back. Uh, but my, my first job is interior designer. Uh, so I create spaces in uh, old uh, houses with appearing uh, stone walls. And, and I bring, I would say, a modern twist to those old buildings. So I go from zero. Uh, from stables to an interior that's extremely spacious and, and accessible, where it's free floating. So. Continue à parler. Oh, d'accord. Continue. Continue. So, yeah, it's uh, creating an interior for everybody, but with a modern twist to it. And I want to. industrial as well. Um, it's very simple but it's accessible to everybody and you can you can create all kind of shapes. Um, you can modular, it's a very modular, you can take off the legs, you can bolt them, uh, place other uh, plateau. Uh, it can be round, it can be uh, square, I mean whatever you want to do you can do it. As long as you have four poles, bolts and the legs you can do whatever you want. How did you meet with Kira? Oh, a long story. Uh, my father worked with Kira. Uh, she's an artist. And uh, he had a gallery in Carcassonne. And uh, so they learned to work together. And uh, Kira introduced me uh, to this. She wanted me to expose here uh, 
Um, so this is a really great opportunity for me because this is my first exposition, uh, especially furniture-wise. Can so, you show me something in the box? Oh my god, that's a secret I can see. 